Hello there guys, welcome back to my channel. So you guys ask and I'm going to deliver what my Rise of the Titans ending would be. Alrighty, so I'm basically just going to start from where it all went wrong. And that is when Jen decides to go back in time. Now the time stone idea, I love that. But I would take that and make it a little better. So yeah, the going back in time, that's a great idea. But why did he have to go so far back? I think it would have been cool to see Jim like going back and trying to fight Belroth, like failing and like, oh, like, I'll go back again and try and fight Belroth. I've said this before, kind of like when, I don't know if you see Miraculous Ladybug, but in Miraculous Ladybug, Adrian gets the snake Miraculous and that snake Miraculous has the power to go back in time. And basically you get to see Adrian try to save Billy Buck so many times. I think it's been so cool to see Jim trying to save his friend so many times. Like something happening, like, oh, if you save Toby, well then someone else would die. Or if you saved Toby, then the end of the world would happen. But eventually, I feel like he would have gotten it right. And then he would have saved the day without having to lose anybody. That would have been really cool, in my opinion, to see Jim um, not going back so far. But using the time zone again and again. And trying to make everything right. Just in that last battle, he wouldn't have to go far that far back. Now, after they made everything right, what I would have liked to see is a little bit of closure. Maybe a funeral for the people who died, like Namora and Strickler and Nari. I think that would have been great. Or like, what's next for these characters? What does Duke have next in store for his life? Does he want to go to college? Does he just want to keep being a wizard? Or Jim and Claire. Claire graduated high school. Jim is still in high school. Would she go back to high school with Jim? Or would she go to college? There's just so many things. Would they get married? Would they have kids? What about Toby? What's next for his life? And, like, Blinky, does he go back to New Jersey with the rest of the trolls and say goodbye to Jim? There's just so many things that I feel like needed closure, and this is what I would have done. But basically, I'm going to start from my ending. Is when Jim would have completely saved everybody. He would use the time stone again and again if he needed to. But he would have finally figured out the perfect combination to keep everybody alive. Now, what's next in store? So unfortunately, Strickler and Amora are still dead, so I'd say funeral. We'd get to see some of the characters in suits, in dresses, which would be nice. Um, but besides that, we'd have some closure with these characters who sacrificed their lives. Like Namora and Strickler. Like, if you look back at their characters in Season 1, that's a huge character development for them to be able to sacrifice their lives. Willing to sacrifice their lives for the greater good. Um, what else would I have had? I would have had some closure with the characters like... Jim and Toby. Yes, I think they'd go back to school. Jim was kind of sad that he wasn't able to go back to school at the end of Troll Hunter Season 3. Now, at the end of Troll Hunter Season 3, we do see that Claire was actually able to graduate school early because she had enough credits. Would she go back to school or would she start college? I think that she would start college, honestly. So then, Toby and Jim would just go to school. And then for Duxie, what's next for Duxie? Um, Honestly, I'm not really sure. I think that he would use the rest of his life trying to protect magic and maybe even training Claire in some of the magic as well. Um, but yeah, like, see, there's so much things that I'd like to know about these characters. For Barbara, what happens with her? Does she just move on with her life? I don't think she would. I think she would still take care of the changelings' familiars and try to find their families for them. Um, Blinky and Arg, for example. What's next for them? I think they would have to go back to New Jersey and leave Jim and Toby behind. And I feel like without the amulet and without the trolls and Strickler and all these other things that were constantly in Jim's life with like the magical trolls and magic and stuff, I think that would be a good way to end the show. Is he finished the job. He protected the trolls. He's like no longer the troll hunter unless he wants to be. But like he's no longer the troll hunter. He protected the trolls. He protected the magic. And now he saved the world, and Arcade is being rebuilt. Um, and Jim, like, he wouldn't have to worry about that anymore with his life. He can move on with his life and focus on what's happening. In this new timeline that they've made, Jim still has to worry about all of this that's going on. And now it's his own responsibility to keep the people alive that had died and try not to make everything be such a disaster. Which I feel like would be a really cool show if they made it a show, but they won't make it a show. So that's the thing. Like, if they made it a show, I'd love that ending. I'd be like, okay, this might be actually kind of interesting to see what happens. But they won't make it a show, so that's the only frustrating part. <laughs> but anyways, yeah, so that'd be kind of my ending. It'd be Jim 
using the time stone not to go so far back. He would use it to go back to the beginning of the fight with Balrog and try to fight until like he would lose. He would go back again to the beginning of the fight. Like it would just be that repetitive until he finally figured out how to keep everybody alive and defeat Balrog. After the defeat of Belrock, I run a funeral for Strickler and Amora, like I said, and basically I just want to know the future of what's next for Jim, Toby, and Claire, and Dixie. Um, I don't feel like that's asking too much. No, but you guys asked, I delivered, that is my ending for Rise of the Titans. Go ahead and let me know what your ending would be in the comments below. Thank you guys for watching, keep it crispy, and have a lively day.